and now really the centerpiece of the day without question his impact on this program as a student athlete competitors just uh, really really huge and I can't think of better names to put on boats than Blessing and Ebright and mostly the reason those names should be there is their spirit and spirit not in the terms of raw raw spirit but something probably something much more profound than that a, a word that's overused but I think that everybody in this group will know what I mean it means their soul their essence they were driving passionate people and they're the kind of people that produce results on a race course and so to have shells bearing their names is just a, a great thing it symbolizes what what we want to have happen the lessons that can be learned on this uh, body of water and the lessons that can be learned from rowing so let's dedicate those two shells don i'd like to turn the mic over to you if you don't mind you've got a wonderful coach he tells me we've got a pretty good crew and have an excellent chance of winning the national championship and if you won the national championship with my name on the shell you don't know what that would do to me. So I'm sorry to be so get overcome by emotion by this, but but I can't help it. I, I guess it, when you get to be 93 years old, you got something to be proud of that you live that long, or had anybody around you live that long, take you that much. Anyway, it's great to be here. I appreciate it. I can never tell you how much I appreciate it. Yeah, it's a wonderful day in my life. Thank you all. Well, I think I'll be remembered for being a coxswain on a winning crew that was an underdog. And I'll always, my, my advice would be what the advice that Kai gave us to me and to the crew as a whole. Get ahead and stay ahead. And that's the way I feel when, you went into, when, I, when I went into business. I wanted to be the best and I wanted to stay the best. And I started in as a messenger boy at Henry S. Swifton Company. And I, 40 years later, I was a senior partner and I, I retired. And uh, I feel that uh, I, I owe most of my success to Kai Ebright, my coach, because he taught me to be a winner and to be a good winner. And that's what I tried to be and hope I am till I die. Yesterday when the famous coxswain Don Blessing gave a speech, now he's 93 year old on, a, on the alumni day, uh, how uh, he's proud of having his name on one of the boats that may win nationals. I just had fire in myself and tears in the eyes and I'm thinking, oh man, I would win everything for you and I'll try to. <laughs>